How's it going YouTube? Today's video is a home brewed 7 element GMRS Yagi antenna. I had a spool of coax cable that we got at the thrift store for a low price, like 6, 7 bucks, something like that. So I cut uh, 15 feet of cord. I put a coax connector on, just regular, because here from the post office, I'm going to go pick up my SMA male and female connectors. So we'll play with those and get those on there and check it out. And then we used a broken rake handle as the frame. And then for the elements, we did coat hangers, steel coat hangers. And then I had some extra braid from, this cable was a little bit longer. And I had a bunch of steel braid that had stripped. So I just cut a few pieces off and coated these three elements. Well, half of this one, this is the negative, this is the positive. And then I'm gonna go outside, get this set up, get it ready for a test. And right here is I'm gonna show you a picture of the measurements. Okay, so there's the measurements. Now I'm gonna get this set up and I'm gonna run to the post office and connect pick up my little connector pieces, get my connector on, and then we'll give this a test. All right, there she is, all mounted, ready to go. Uh, check the post office today. They didn't come, so I'll have to finish this tomorrow. And, yep, it looks pretty good. I got my little antenna right there. You can kind of see it right there. That thing gets really good signal. So, But, yeah, so I have the Yagi yeah, pointed in the same direction. Going out that way. And we'll see how it does. All right, the connector's finally came. So these are just simple coax to SMA female and male. Let's see what we got. These three different kinds. So I just simply. Male on one end, female on the other. And bam, just like that. You get yourself an extension cable. Alright. I'm going to get one of these on the end, and I'm going to give the radio a test. And it's raining out today, and thundering, and terrible weather, so... We shall see how this works. Alright, so I'm all connected here. There she is on the connector. Alright, let's give her a run. WRU Echo 980 on my home brewed Yagi antenna. How am I sounding? WQYD 470. You sound good, Josh. Copy that. Uh, audio is crystal clear on the response as well. Uh, thank you very much. Yeah, that's uh, that. You know, your other last antenna sounded good, but this one here, you're on your. Uh, you've got a lot stronger signal as well. Awesome. Copy that. did a good job and uh, that was uh, that was a project well done 10 four yeah I took my time and it took about a week so I'm, I'm glad it turned out well it sounds really good you coming through nice and crisp oh yeah yeah no problems there at all Josh yeah, he did uh, he did a good job on that yeah like you said that's the fun stuff Roger that. Well, cool. Thank you very much. Um, I'm going to get back to the side and get this little mess cleaned up real quick. Ten four. You have a good one there. WQYD 470. 
Roger that. We'll talk to you a little bit later tonight. WRU Echo 980. I'll be clear. So that antenna works great. And it's a stormy day today, so way past my expectations. So there you go. Homebrewed Yagi antenna and little elements. I'll leave a link down for the elements down below so you guys can check those out. They're $8.99. They're pretty affordable. Alright, so please leave a like and subscribe and share this video with your friends. Thank you very much.